We're in the very beautiful gardens uh, with Vic Southwell from Magic Bus, and I suppose this is an incredibly different setting to the charity that you work with. Yeah, it absolutely is. We work um, across India so with some of the poorest children in the world, so somewhere like this is, is quite different from the environments that we deliver our programmes in every day. And how did the link with the Wimbledon Foundation start, and how, how long has it been going on for? So we run a programme in India that is very much about helping children move away from poverty, so making sure they finish their education, resisting challenges such as underage marriage and child labour, and then helping them find jobs that are secure and pay a really decent salary. So um, a lot of what we do is using sports, and we started having a conversation with Wimbledon Foundation in about 2015 about whether it would be possible to bring tennis to our programmes. Tennis in India isn't really a sport that's played by the masses, so it felt like a really interesting challenge to see if we could incorporate tennis into what we do um, and really see how much the children were going to enjoy learning a sport that they'd never really had any exposure to. It's very different, isn't it? We're somewhere where people are desperately trying to get tickets to come and watch the tennis, but, but you're teaching children in India about a sport that they don't necessarily know. Wimbledon presumably doesn't mean that much to them there. No, I mean, Wimbledon probably doesn't have a great deal of resonance. Tennis itself isn't really a sport that's played by the masses. Obviously, cricket is huge in India, but the children we work with absolutely love playing sports. So we've been able to really easily encourage them to give tennis a go. We've been able to really easily find a way of all the learning that the children undertake through our sessions, being able to incorporate different ways of playing tennis into making sure that at the end of those sessions they're coming away still having achieved what we want them to do. And they've just had a fantastic time trying a sport that is completely new to them. And in some instances, some of our young people have learnt some basic tennis coaching as well and are starting to earn money going into schools and tennis clubs and actually teaching children tennis as well. And changing the lives of people that come from poverty, Magic Bus and Wimbledon Foundation are, are making a huge difference, aren't they? They are, absolutely. Um, you know, like I said, we work with some of the poorest children in the world, um, families that are living on less than $2 a day. Um, so the programme itself that we run means that the children we work with are finishing school, um, we're helping them find jobs, and one of the key things is that Wimbledon Foundation not only support the work we do in communities, but they fund a livelihood centre, which is where our young people go for three months, have really intensive, immersive experience, so at the end of that they're work ready, and then they're going out and they're getting jobs that are significantly different from anything that their families have ever done before. They're secure jobs with good salaries, and they're not only taking themselves out of poverty, but the whole family out of poverty as well. So the difference to the 3,000 children and young people we're working with directly through Wimbledon Foundation support is absolutely massive. Yeah, it's incredibly important work. Thank you, Vic. Thank you.